Hey guys, it's Jennifer in my Aldi sweatshirt. I love this thing. So if you ever see this in the Isle of Shame, oh my gosh, it's so soft and so good. Anyway, I have a five and five for you guys. So let's jump right in. All right, so let me go ahead and grab some things here. The first thing I'm gonna talk to you about is Pureology Hydrate Shampoo and Conditioner. These are really, really, really good. They're not my my preferred Holy Grail um, shampoo and conditioner combo. I've talked about that in other videos. But for travel, these are so good. The conditioner is great. The shampoo is great. There's kind of like a little bit of a minty feel um, in here, and the lather is excellent. So yeah, these are really good. They're really moisturizing as well. So I've really enjoyed using those. All right, my camera is falling, so hopefully that'll stay, all right? So the next thing is this Shani Darden Cleansing Serum. I don't like this. It really is very serum-y and it feels very oily-y. So imagine kind of washing your face with olive oil. It doesn't lather. Um, that's what it's like. I had to double cleanse with this also because I don't feel like this removed my makeup at all. It smells amazing. I just, this is not the kind of cleansing experience that I love, so I would not purchase that. Um, all right, so the next thing is this Kenzip Self Smooth, Kenship Self Smooth. So first of all, this lasted forever. It's like a 10% um, gly glycolic resurfacing serum. There's still some in here. I cannot express enough how much I hated this product. If you love using glycolic acid, you would love this because it is strong and it resurfaces, but it is so irritating to me. Um, I use good jeans. I've used several glycolic toners and as long as I use them responsibly and sparingly and not like every single day and not on the same days I use retinol and stuff like that, I have no problem. But this burned every single time I put it on. It was just so irritating. It was just too strong for me. So I would say I would not recommend this with the caveat that it was not good for my skin. But this may be something that's perfect for you if you can handle it, but it was just too much for me. All right, this is a non, non-empty, which I try not to do, but this is one of those cases where I have to. This is the Maybelline Sun Kisser Blush. I was sent this free for review um, from Influencer, and I hate this blush. So for one thing, the color is absolutely gorgeous. It's in City Sizzle, and I love the color. And I was really excited about it, especially because um, it's really, it's a very sheer, nice formula. It blends out, and it just looks like this sun kiss glow. It's really nice this caused my cheeks to break out something awful um, you can actually see here where it's recovering and here where it's recovering so both sides it was the only product that was new that I used um, so yeah this just it didn't play well with my skin I went actually online to look up reviews to see if this was an anomaly if this was just something that for me was not good and the reviews are not great because of a lack of pigment it is a sheer sort of sun-kissed formula um, so I get that but I didn't see a whole lot of people saying it broke them out. So this may, again, just be something that was unique to my skin, which I wouldn't say is super sensitive. I don't think my skin is super sensitive, um, but I'm going to have to see. I'm going to actually give it to my sister and see if maybe she wants to try it and see what kind of experience she has. But I felt that I owed it to you guys to be honest about what I experienced. All right, finally, 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 we have the Pharmacy Whipped Greens Oil-Free Foaming Cleanser. I love this cleanser. It is so nice. If you know the pharmacy cleansing balm, that is this, except not in a balm in a squirt. So it is actually a thicker formula. It comes out kind of thick. And then as you start to work it into your hands, it just lathers and it turns wonderful. And you can just oh smear it all in. It's great for taking off makeup. I really, really, really enjoyed this. So this was something that was a major win. So I wanted to share that experience with you guys. All right, that's it for me. I hope everybody's doing great and I will see you guys in my next one. Bye.